Yo, 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 what's good? We back up on top, baby. You guys ready ready for some secret sauce? What you got for us? All right, so in this game, you guys are going to do what everybody loves to do in Heroes of the Storm. Oh, God. A minute. And just play the game, roll the dice. It's like it's like Sto- it's like Storm League. Okay? What does that even mean? What does that mean? Already. So... Are you making us play without comms? No. <laughs> <laughs> Although, because <laughs> that would be fucking tilting. All right. Uh, then, don't 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 test me. But no. So we're, the game's <laughs> gonna be ro- the game's gonna be roll the dice. Um, okay. So we're all gonna. I'm gonna need you guys to hop over to the Heroes stream if you would like to see. I'm I'm watching. Okay, so what we have here oh. is a list oh. of characters. Um, oh, rolls. Great. And we also have oh, a, a dice. Um, so Christ. what we're going to do here is we are going to, you know, randomly, right, as, so they say, uh, draft your comms for, your, for yourself. So uh, uh, as, uh, as our lovely Jules um, should hopefully begin spinning some dice we'll, we'll start with turkish delights team as they were the victor of the last game and we're going to build the comp and and then we'll and then we'll put smiler's comp together so here we go so we got a number two so we got a muradin main tank rolling for bruiser we have a rexar bruiser wait who gets these things this is turkish delights comp that's oh, building this, is, yeah, right this is this is your comp yes right here right now yes <laughs> Murden, Rexar. Yeah, assassin rolling now. Six. That's a butcher assassin. Oh, oh. Come on, Jules. Okay, another roll. Assassin number two. Number four. Come on, number four. Give me Asmodan. Yes. Oh, no. oh, they're gonna they're gonna get a legit comp and we're gonna get Butcher Asmodan. Okay. They're gonna get Diva Valera again. And we have the support. This is rigged. And we have the support roll. Lily, oh, <laughs> this is actually there, so rigged. It's not even the funny. Yeah. Yeah. The Turkish delight is Murden, Rexar, Butcher, Asmodan, Lily. So give okay, Moon so, Murky again. I want to so get now we're, yeah, so actually now we're going getting the, trolled out of our minds. So now we're going to the Smilers draft. So we we'll oh, start it off with the tank. We have a Murden, a mirror match. Okay. 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 All right. A test of skill. So let's do the Bruiser. We have a Rex. We're just a mirror. We're just okay. mirror guys. Okay. 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 Butcher. Butcher. Jules, I feel like I'd be Jules, okay with you. Do or can we? Yeah. Can we roll those first two? I don't want to do mirror matchups. Like <laughs> no, bro. You gotta yeah, obey the dice, roll. man. Yeah, obey the dice. Nice. The dice. The dice decide. The, the dice, dice decide. don't lie, bro. You gotta obey them. I don't okay, so we have, what do we have? Yep. <laughs> Junkrat. Okay, so Orphea Junkrat. Wait, they just got better Asmodan. I'm tilted. <laughs> last pick is support. Lightning. Oh. Uh. Yeah, what, right. are you, what are you talking about, Trick? It's no. gonna be a, it's gonna be a Misha Misha matchup. How, <laughs> how, how am I not gonna make that happen? Of course, I can't oh, bear God. it. Of course, that's gonna oh, happen. Yeah, you can't God. bear it. Yep. <laughs> you can't you better be ready. You're gonna catch some so claws. Smilers, as so. the losing team, what map do you want? to uh, now that you know your draft, mm-hmm. that's actually so busted that they, yeah, they can choose yeah. the, cup, the map yeah, around their cup. Y'all got to do the same oh, for the wait. game. Yeah, okay. that's just the way of the rules. You know, there's there's things like Garden of Terror. You know, I don't want to influence yeah, I'm or anything. Not fucking touching that map. Wait, I love Garden of Terror. <laughs> no, no, we didn't get to choose our comp, and we just got the rule and then the map, not the comp and then the map. Yeah, but you knew you were gonna be playing melee. Yeah, it's oh. not the same though. Not the same. What? Uh, how, what? I want no, to. I want to. Then, then, then you need. Then you know. Honestly, win one. And then be, Wait, we are up one. one. What do you mean? We, we did win one. one. Yeah, start losing and then. Yeah, start losing. Game. That's it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Two one. What do you mean? Yeah, win yeah. one. Start, lo- start losing. That's it. Yes. yes oh my god. Okay. Okay. Uh, thinking. That's why I had the clown. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Boe. All right. Yeah, we, uh, we have Asmodan Butcher on <laughs> Battlefield <laughs> of Eternity. Damn. Honestly, good choice, Moon. That was well played. Thank well you. Played. 
Perfect, um, perfectly, perfect use of strategy. I'm wow. gonna go play Dota, dude. This game is trash. <laughs> yeah, everyone goes first. Can we do game five on League? Oh, is that a yay God. or nay? Uh, I'll consider it. Yes! Can we, can we tiebreaker gonna, Rocket League? I'm not gonna say no, but I'm not saying no. yes either. I think that'd be sick. Right now we're playing heroes, though. <laughs> true, true, true. All right. <sighs> like bats, disperse. Bye. So I think it's really gonna come down to how well they chain CC, right? Because obviously, Murden stun into a junk rat trap or a mine even into a knockback into a Rexar stun. Like that's a lot of damage there. That's a lot of CC, uh, and, and and it moves the person around. So it's it's harder for Lily. You know she needs people to be near her, right, to to heal them up. Uh, I don't know. It'll, it'll, it's going to be a very interesting game. Uh, I'm excited for it, and I think the 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 big ticket here is going to be the Murden players. They they're, they're going to have to control the map for their team. Uh, they're going to have to kind of create space so that their team can either race or deal damage or um, and hopefully in this case use drain build as asthma but I'm feeling pretty scared about it because he's, he has taken wrath at level one so probably an auto attack build well on the left hand side for smilers we've got Junkrat played by Vesper we've got Lakefo and white main Mune is going to be on the Orphea big scoop on the Muradin and Allura on the Rexar and looking at Turkish Delight we have Trixler on the Rexar Mockery playing the Butcher it's going to be Leon Black on the Muradin, Turk on the Asmodan, and Akai taking on the Lili, the Panda Pal. Oh, looking, Isn't already the... looking le level one, looking for those stacks. That's what I love to see. Mm -hmm. I, I personally, like, I, I love Wrath just because you're going to be in these long gate. You, you, you can get so much value off of it as you actually talent into other talents, and we don't have to focus too much on this because we are going to actually have it being a... Uh, we have a dive in the top lane onto Allure, and they're going to burn them Ooh. down. That's going to be first blood in favor for the members of Turkish Delight, and that's actually going to be... I believe that's going to be... 30 mm. stacks because they Mockery got is and Megan yeah. Hamburger. 40, 47 that, stacks that already. Literally 47 stacks, 40-some seconds into this game. Is it okay... To say that Mockery is maybe making Misha burgers, I'm not really sure. Uh, but you know, he, he the pickup does happen here. We do see the sun coming out from Leon Bono, Black onto Big Scoop. Moonfair is just getting out some damage here, just exchanging, exchanging. You know, maybe maybe we'll see one of these two teams go down into that easy camp off of the priority in the lane. Turk trying his best to stack here. Actually, it's it's, it's nice to see the teams actively looking to stack Turk. Maybe question mark. It's it's difficult because I mean you you want to hit as many people with your with your annihilation as possible. Junkrat with the concussion mine actually getting away from Mockery, but they're going to continue to in, in in fight over this uh this front gate, and they're not going to be able to find the kill just yet. It's actually Misha ends up going down, and that's actually I think that's a Misha bear in favor for the members of Turkish Delight or on their side, so they're going to have to just cycle back right here. And, do you know? Uh, yeah, that was yeah. Do you know if? Misha drops stacks. Oh my! Wait, the mine coming out from Turk. A great mine here. Yes. Does Misha Liam. drop blood stacks for, yeah. for Butcher? Yeah. I believe so. That's what I was getting at the beginning because okay. when they killed Rexar and when they killed Rexar, Misha dies too. And I believe. Yeah. Okay. That's why they, I went, they, they were at 40. Fish. They were they were they were at 40 stacks, 40 seconds yeah. in. There's yeah. no way they hit that many minions. For um, sure. And it's only 15 per, per hero kill right now. Once you finish up the 200, you only get 10 uh, per hero kill after that. But okay. bottom lane siege coming in in favor for the members of the Smilers, looking to go up 2-2 in our best of seven series here. And honestly, just showing that they don't need an easy camp. They're just Using that poke from the Junkrat and the Orphea, Moon's actually able to take down the well as well. So that's that's already an advantage mm -hmm. right there. Um, not being able to tap the well, maybe if the objective is on the south side, which it looks to be. Hmm, not really sure. So uh, for observers, how can I tell? Always, yeah, for as an observer, you will always see the Immortals as the blue team side. So this, uh, so these swords will be the race for the blue team, and the shield will be the defense for. The okay, so it always, yeah, it, it always as an observer, you'll always see it that way. If you okay. actually literally swap to the enemy's vision, then it will change. But that's that's okay. Yeah, so so in this case, they they aren't punished for that. Um, having the tap there, unless they choose to race, and. We see Smilers defend. I, I would say Smilers probably has a more aggressive comp, maybe. Uh, but if if Turkish Delight were to retreat off of that race from their position, they they would go down to a fort that has no well there to tap. But Turk is looking like he's going to get caught out here in the bottom lane. So we now have a hero advantage. We probably look to see either a engage here, maybe a four v five forced, or we could just get the first fifty on the immortal. Maybe split the team on that. We do have a camp pushing in the bottom lane, that hard camp with the summoners. And we do see like, a 4v5? 
Butcher running out towards Moonfair. They're going to be trying to lock them down. Orphea will be getting picked off. That's another 15 stacks for Mockery at 91 currently. For anyone wondering at home, almost halfway through those stacks as they need to max out at 200. And um, it much, I mean, much like Hansa with Redemption or uh, Wisdom Duelist from Greymane, you lose a little bit when you do die on that Butcher before you finish them out. Well, Wise and Duelist isn't a good example. But anyways, you will get what I'm saying is the top lane for it will be going down. The Immortal Phase is pretty much... It's still at a standstill. Do you want to like? Do you want to jump in some of the comms here? As we are going to be getting into a mortal face, probably a team fight. Yeah, let's let's uh, let's jump into Turkish Delights comms. Okay. I'm just everyone on the phone. Okay. Come here. I'm, I'm here. Uh, I'm looking at chill right now. Uh, Can you just find a backliner and you just charge them once? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna look gotcha. for the flank here. Oh, I see a Vesper team. You get to this Rexar. I'm trying. I'm walking. Yeah, it's, it's really far. It's really far. I'm charging. I'm charging. I'm charging. I'm charging. Oh shit! Never mind. Man. Oh, fuck, man. I just leave it. Yeah. Hey, I'm hey, probably hey, like. Target. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, we're good. We're good. I want to tap. I want to tap. Okay. Yeah, I gotta tap too. I'm getting one v one by Orphan. Turk just walks by me. <laughs> <laughs> like no fucking man. Just waddles his way to the immortal. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming back. I have charge again. Can you look at junk rat? Oh, Vesper team. Vesper team. Vesper team. Vesper team. Vesper team. Vesper team. Charging Rex. Charging Rex. Charging Rex. Yo, Laura, 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 Laura. Hang on, I'm helping with backline here. Oh my God, there's a free kill right here, dude. Come on, come on, come on. You're trolling me, Lake Fu, Lake Fu, Lake Fu, Lake Fu, Lake Fu, Lake Fu. Wait man, wait man, wait man, wait man, wait man, wait man. I need to leave. He's slowed. Taking damage. Orphia, 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 Shot calling is somebody wants some meat. That's what that's what somebody I'm wants some meat. Yeah, it's like they they mockery wants to stack up and be done. Also, to note, I'm looking at this. Murden has already finished out the baseline Stormbolt quest. They've gotten 25 stacks already. Oh my! Like Leon Black on this Murden is already clear. I mean, Big Scoop is sitting at 13 out of the 25. So not to take away from them, that it's just Leon right now is already finishing that. And that's I think the quickest I've ever seen it when I've been casting a game. But uh, this is Immortal Phase, looking like the members of Turkish Delight might be able to grab this here as we have a dive in from Big Scoop. They're gonna try and lock down Leon Black, but it will not happen. And it looks like they're just able to disengage from this right here. And they're not even trying to race this because the moment the members of Smilers send one to race, they're gonna see that that health going down on their Immortal and the Turkish Delights are gonna be stepping forward. So while they're kind of just zoning, they're gonna take advantage of this moment. Uh, looks like Kyberries and Leon Black are gonna be hearthing back to be able to get full on mana from the Hall of Storms. Nisha gonna be hackling a little bit here from Trixler, but that that's Misha Bear going down, sacrificed for a little bit of harass as Alora is actually using the Misha Bear on the left hand side over here to actually start working on the Immortal. So really good uh, micro control coming out from Alora utilizing that bear to get some Immortal race in their favor as uh, Butch is going to stack out through bottom lane. But we have another fight breaking out potentially this Immortal phase here. I think the the real, oh, Turk's actually getting caught out here too, maybe by the big scoop. Mockery, Dusty, Vestratine looking to charge. He knows that the mine is there to knock him back. but. I was gonna say Leon actually opted to go Stormbolt at four. Yeah, right? so he's got the sledgehammer, and I think that's really kind of skewing this. Moon getting charged here from the butcher. It is gonna connect. No follow up, but great mind to knock people away. Turk looking with a basketball from the deep end. A nice Rexar stun from Trick. Double stun. Vesper is able to get out, but Leon will follow up stun as well. Passive looking. Deal some damage there. Leon does go down there on the Junkrat, and we have a 9 10 push. With the Junkrat down, a pretty much main source of damage here on the Immortal. I think we might even be able to get to the keep wall here with that Sledgehammer, especially. Moon so actually so needs to be careful here, too. I think. Uh... Charge. Dunk coming in from Asmodan. There's a whole lot of bursts on the Moon. They're going to try and use the endpoint to get themselves further away from there. That Shadow Wall is helping them out a ton. Misha Bear will be going down to the Asmodan. Some more stacks for the Butcher. What's sitting at 173 currently. Jugs are going to be dropped by uh, Kai as well just to heal up the friendly team. The Jugs of a Thousand Nopes, as I like to call it, because if you try and kill someone, those are out. It's really not going to be happening, but still 10 talent here in favor for Turkish Delight as they find a kill under Rexar. And they're going to continue to push in through this bottom lane here. A trick just kind of letting the other team know that he, he, he is theirs. <laughs> But they are on the retreat here. That bear might be able to connect the stun here. Double stun coming out. Is there any follow-up? 
Big Scoop jumping in. A nice Orphea ult here. Mockery is going to be taken down there. I think he does lose some stacks. Kai, a Haymaker Playmaker for my man Big Scoop. Getting Kai Berries out of position. That was that, that Haymaker was for Nicole. Turk held over here, almost taking down Moon. That's redeemed with a rip tire? Are you uh, kidding me? to the face from Leon as they're going to turn this around, but Turk ends up getting picked off. Leon dives in, Trixler back into this fight. Misha Bear with a huge charge. The uh, Divine Reckoning coming out from the White Man as well as Big Scoop gets the dwarf, dwarf House over the wall. No Misha Bear to be killed on the right-hand side, but an insane back and forth. Bottom lane Punisher did, or excuse me, Immortal did get almost the majority of that keep as the Misha Bear on the opposing side gets sniped by the Nexus forces. Butcher looking for an angle to get in here. 162 on their stacks. Lily coming in here does get the blind on to this Rexar as they chase further in. Big Scoop diving in. They get the oh, land no. of slaughter and murdered and goes down. 182 stacks on this Butcher. They're looking for another charge. The slows will be there. Can they find a charge onto Moonfares here? It was such a tragedy what happened there. The cleanse came out as Tim had jumped right in and was picked up from that land of the slaughter. Actually, Tricks are caught out here. It looks like he is going to be taken down here. Lakeview doing a great job of sustain. Allure getting a stun there on Kai to stop the healing. Leon Black has just jumped in. He's asserting dominance. Mockery following up as well. He looks like he is going to complete his quest here. The juice. 10 minutes. Bloodied Butcher. Uh, this, this is a huge power stacks. spike, right? Huge power yeah. spike. 210 stacks. Butcher currently hits for 447 in auto attack. Two. And uh, just to let you all know, too, if you're wondering about Asmodan stacks, 167 on those. Um, pretty standard. Like, this is the build that I like to always go into because it gets you a lot of push pressure, also a lot of good uh, auto attack reduction onto your abilities as well. But right now, Leon Black is just currently fighting as Mockery cycled back to go get a camp. They're going to be re engaging as we have a bit of a split fight. Orphe on the right hand side. Junkrat will be getting picked off. 20, 10 more stacks for Mockery on this Butcher. And uh, they're going to be actually continuing to chase in. Big Scoop in a bit of a rough spot. Oh. And they find a kill onto them as well. Just more and more passive damage onto that Butcher with every kill he gets as well. He might just be able to chunk chunk this keep down yeah it looks like the keep is going to go down the objective is going towards smilers oh no just kidding it's going towards turkish lights side they are going to get a 50 50 fight here from smilers they need to kind of try to figure out how they want to fight right it seems like it's, it's a fairly s simple direction coming out from turkish light right they, they butcher charge maybe leon jumps in he causes some commotion and then we're, we're trying to one shot that target uh it seems like smiles is having a hard time kind of trying to figure out where they're at in these fights a turkish delights it's just it you actually heard in their comms they're like looking for backline targets just keep diving into backline mm -hmm. targets and they're doing that consistently well tricks are gonna get caught out right there jugs come out a touch too late the rip tire was out from the junk red as well this is immortal very very low mockery gonna get haymaker to wade but vesper teams right next to them lambda slaughter goes out doesn't connect onto them in time allura looking to get some damage over here on the left hand side of our screen <laughs> onto that butcher they do find the kill no stacks to reset because they are stacked up that is going to be asmodan finishing out their level one quest and that is an orphia going down the turk able to walk away with some 500 health leon actually being saved by the concussion mine potentially, Stormbolt. Dwarf toss. Uh, I think Murden's able to get it. They they do have their uh their their baseline trait proccing right there as Vesper. I don't think will have enough damage. He might Maybe. actually just oh, die to Leon. Yeah. I was gonna say this is uh, Liam is trying to flex too hard here. God, and that's a zero to three. <laughs> oh no. Ooh. Yeah. Mm. But the race does go Turkish Delight's way. And we do have no wall there in the top lane as well. The keep is exposed. A better, a, a much better fight there, right? We were able to CC out the Butcher and t take him down. Big Scoop, nice cleanse here. Trying to get him out. Moon steps in as the tank for the day. He is going to get Butcher charged. And Asmodonk almost taking out Big Scoop as well. Lakefoot was dumping some heals into that. Again, you really need to not lose those ranged damage dealers, especially right here before the objective. But this is, this is looking dire. This immortal coming in for 746 in auto. This this top lane keep is about to fall. Concussion mine's gonna be separating them with the junk rat. There's gonna be divine reckoning out from the white main as well. Rip tire comes out from junk rat, but I think they might use that to clear back the wave. Maybe yeah, I think I think you throw it on the wave and try and get as much AOE damage onto the enemy team as possible. The immortal moves up, attacking from range as it does have its shield still. Core is starting to fall a little bit here. As excuse me, core shielding is starting to fall here as they get the butcher charge in. That's gonna be the oh, lambda slaughter. The crushing dust comes out. They are gonna get the turnaround, so it's gonna be a one for one in a sense right there. As Misha did get picked off as well. Turk gonna just dunk into Lake Foo's face. The Immortal is still attacking the core. That will be Asmodan going down. Immortal still dealing damage, and that will be the members of Turkish Delight going up. 
three to one in our best of seven series. GG, well played. Just a, a great showcase of what Butcher can do if he gets, you know, one too many stacks, right? Uh, and you would think that Ten minutes. Moon had taken this map as a counter even, right? Mm -hmm. He was like, okay, we need we need to stop the Butcher from getting stacks. How do we do it? Let's take the two-lane map. But what he didn't think about was the fact that the Butcher can just kill them over and over again. <laughs> and, and he got stacked up through that. So Basically. overall, I think a really good game.